that you expect that early in the will we'll take it advantage. Have you experienced that already? Uh, yes, sir. It's been really awesome, you know, to go ahead and get in the classroom, start weightlifting a little bit, you know, kind of get into the swing of things. And you're getting that edge up from everybody else that's coming in the summer. You know, I, I think it, it's, it's going to benefit me a lot. Why Tennessee? Um, you know, I'm a Tennessee guy. I was born and raised in the state of Tennessee. Been cheering for the Big Orange my whole life. And, you know, uh, I, I just couldn't see any other place for me to go. You know, that's it's been my dream to run out of the tee. You know, so I, I really can't I really can't wait for that day. Just they played so many for true freshmen this past year. Did that factor into your decision one way or the other at all, or was there anything you paid much attention to? Or? I mean, it did. You know, it's good to know that I could have a be in a position to have early playing time. But at the same time, I think Tennessee was. I mean, they offered me two days later. I committed. It was. I knew this is where I wanted to be. Jack, you describe your, your, sorry, your your skill set. What do you bring to the table? You know, you're going to get a guy that uh, comes to work every day, and I like to say I play the game with a uh, physical edge. You know, I, I like to play nasty. You know, but um, I, I'm going to be smart. I'm going to know what I'm doing. But really, you're just going to get a hardworking guy. What's the most important thing you want to get out of this semester? I mean, you know, like I said, I just want to get in the swing of things. You know, I really want to get a lot stronger in the weight room. And, um, you know, I'll get a lot of work in with uh, the coaches and everything, just learning the new uh, plays and uh, just the new technique and all that. So, um, but spring practice really will be a big, a big benefit as well, you know, because those practice days, they mean, they mean a lot in the development of a player. Have you talked to some of the older players at your position, and what has your interaction been like with the, the players that are already here? I've talked a lot with them. Uh, Coleman Thomas, that's my big brother. And um, all, really all the guys have just taken me in. And, uh, yeah, they've, they've been done a real good job of that. And they're already kind of showing me the ropes a little bit. So, uh, yeah, I'm very grateful for the great offensive line. Got all these guys are really good dudes. Jack, even though you're in high school, you knew you were coming here, and, and the Tennessee offensive line kind of taking you know, some hits with all the sacks given up. I mean, even though you were in high school, knew you were coming here, is that something that you listened to and you kind of took personally? You know, um, Tennessee's offensive line, they're, they're really young. And um, I, I really I really want to come up here and help any way I can. And I just want to be out there and do anything for Coach Mahoney, Coach Jones, any way they need me. Um, you know, I think this offensive line's really making made a lot of strides this year, and they did a great job. Um, as the year developed, they just got better and better. And I hope to continue that into next year. We're just going to keep getting better and better. And if it means me getting to play a little bit, that's awesome. But I'm just, I'm here to work. And I'm um, hopefully I get to play early. But if I don't, is what it is. But I'm having a mindset of I'm here to work. And I'm here to get this offensive line and this team better. You said it's a dream. Is that surrealness feeling? Is it still there? You know, you're wearing the colors. You're in this room. Is it? Is it still kind of in awe? Yeah, this is all pretty surreal right now. You know, I've I've I've, I've seen this. You know, being recruited, seeing guys getting interviewed and stuff and now it's my it's my turn and um it, it's pretty wild you know it's gonna but it, I, I really think it's gonna be a great experience um I'm, I'm loving it so far um just being able to come in here and train in this awesome facility it's been awesome and uh, i can't i can't wait to uh keep getting better and better i know it's early but have the coaches given you stuff to work on already i mean what get in the weight room and then um, stuff on the field too well yeah I, I've, I've already been in meetings like i was in a 45 an hour meeting just now for uh, learning plays and everything. So um, yeah, it's it's we've already been working, and then I've been doing stuff on my own. It, it, it's been really great, you know, because like the, having this right here, this whole this big facility right here, you're able to come in whenever you want and get some work in. It just makes it easy to do that, and um, so I, I really like that part of it. Jack, what kind of recruiter have you been within this class with other guys that have already committed, and then other targets that are still out there? Um, you know, I've recruited a lot. Uh, Kyle Phillips, that was like, that was the guy right there that I really worked on. I spent a lot of time talking to Kyle because we, you know, we both worked with in full motion and um, we've been going against each other since we were sophomores, freshmen. So we're really, we were really tight. And, you know, it was more to me, like, Kyle was a really one of my close friends. So I was kind of like, I want you to do what's best for you. But what's best for you is to come to Tennessee. So why don't you go ahead and get up here? But I, I, I mean, I, I didn't know till like the Friday before he committed that he was coming here. And he was messing around with me the night before, like saying stuff, and I was like, oh my gosh, this is gonna be terrible. But he came, I'm really excited by that. And everybody else, you know, we've got a group message going. We've been having that since, uh, since, we, since everybody's been committed. So um, it's been really great to uh, get to know these guys and to kind of recruit some of these guys to come and join me. Who's on that message? 
uh, every, everyone's everybody. In, everyone's in there. <coughs> I know a lot of you guys are were excited about the direction of the program. You know, when you committed, mm -hmm. I guess a long time ago. But when you saw this season ended with a, a strong finish in the bowl win, I mean, how much more excited does that get you to, to come here and actually be a part of it now? Oh, it's great stuff. I, I really, honestly, I would have been, I would have been at the vault walk for that game. I would have been sitting in the stand for that game. But I had an Under Armour game I had to go to. It was the same same day. But uh, yes, it's it's exciting. The excitement around here is awesome too. It's seeing these guys that have worked so hard the past few years, and they're getting to uh, get talk. They're talking about getting their bowl rings and stuff. You know, I'm just looking at that, being like, this is pretty awesome. It's going to be even better when we're winning bigger games against bigger teams, and we're just getting better and better and better. Jack, do you have more questions? Do you have a sense of how the coaches want to use you on the offensive line in terms of what position, which side of the line, things like that yet? Are you going to cross train or, or what? I mean, I'm going to try to learn everything I can. Um, you know. Uh, I honestly don't know that much yet, but uh, we'll see. We'll see when we get there. I think spring practice will be a big. We'll start to figure that out more, and then um, we'll go from there. Do you view yourself more as a tackler guard at this point? I don't. I, I view myself as somebody that can play both. Um, I, I'm going to work hard at both, and um, we'll see. We'll, like we'll see what happens. Jack, you committed Thanks, so long ago. What, what was the wait like to, to actually get here and report? Um,